Hi and welcome back to my channel. I'm Sylvia De Silva. In today's video, I'm gonna talk about stencils. So when I was a part of a group art show earlier this year, a lot of people, a lot of artists who visited uh, kept asking me how I created certain effects in my paintings. Take a look at them. Everyone wanted to know how I created this. Well, the trick was airbrushing with good stencils. So, stencils are not easily available in India, good ones. Well, Itsy Bitsy, the store has always been a great help. I found good stencils there, but there are very limited ones. So, what do you do when you don't really have the stencils that you really need? So, when I started off, I really didn't want to spend too much on stencils. So what I did was I bought these OHP sheets, plastic ones. So let me show you a few of my stencils. So this one I bought from Itsy Bitsy, this store. And I really love this script uh, stencil that I have. You might find it at Itsy Bitsy. I found out that stencils, good stencils were not really available online. So what I do is I buy these OHP sheets. I don't know if they still use these for PowerPoint presentation kind of a thing. This is what were used in the 90s. So before that, I look for the silhouette uh, images online. Suppose I want a dandelion. So I look for dandelion silhouettes on Google and whatever image I find, I take a printout of something that I really want to use as a stencil. So I take that printout, I place it under this and I draw on it using a permanent marker. So I don't know if you can see this. So I've drawn on it. Or this was for a galaxy stencil. Anyway, for this I used an X-Acto knife. What I did was I placed this on top of a cutting mat and I used the X-Acto knife and cut out the parts that I had traced. So yes, it is a lot of work, it takes a lot of time, but when you don't have anything to work with, that is what you do. You do a little bit of hard work. This is the dandelion stencil that I used. This again, I made this, I cut out this using an X-Acto knife and you'll see the effects i'll just show you in a bit the wonderful effects that you can create with just a stencil and an airbrush this again is one of my favorites i did the same thing again this was made by me with an exacto knife and it took hours to make this but it really paid off the effects are so wonderful so yeah when you don't know where to buy stencils from this is mostly for indians because i'm sure stencils are easily available in the uk and the us and places where it is not easily available well this is what you can do so this is how i store my stencils i have a box file I have these sleeves in which I insert the stencils that I've created. Alright, and when I didn't really have this idea, I used to make it on papers. That you can that could be like a one-time use thing. So this is one of the very first ones that I made. Also this one. I used a magazine because it's really thick paper so I wanted to create this one I wanted to create this one so that's what I made using a magazine I just cut it out with a blade 
and voila. I hope that information helped a little bit and thank you so much for watching. Do subscribe to my channel and hit the notification button and I'll see you again in the next video so have a great day.